Uh, so, sandwiches? Mm, sandwiches. Quint will start telepathically pinging the nearby people. Uh, just, just going, you know. Bonobus is en route, so don't worry. My lies have truth to them. So, uh, see just, you. just, just, just yeah, camp, I guess. Going. Grab some food. <laughs> Come back out. You see Barnabas directing these officers into uh, making sure the seating arrangements are of respectable condition. Barnabas. So good to see you. Telepathically saying, I'm in disguise. What is the name of your disguise? Yvonne. Silent Y. Ah, uh, Lady Yvonne. He does a low bow. It is a pleasure. I assume Clint picked up some flourishes being in Andorra for a while, so reciprocate. <laughs> Look at the guard. <laughs> Trying to get the, the old clear on the... You can't touch us, uh huh. Hee <laughs> hee. She, like, looks straight ahead, almost at an attention pose, with, uh, building anger underneath. <laughs> She's like, son of a bitch, I had them, I, I just need to land it, I missed. <laughs> this was gonna be my promotion. <laughs> the cold case of the horse thief. I think Elena will love these. Don't you? The lady knows Lady Elena's taste far better than I, but I am inclined to agree. Oh, and this is for you. Give over, like, a <laughs> to-go sandwich to the court. Thank you. Thank you. I think the lady god forgets herself. I believe that is thank you, madam. <laughs> I got the feeling Barbus gets get some kick out of this. Thank Barbus just know. dunked on her, of course he does. So, shall we be off then? I think we have some meetings to attend to before we head out. Yes, very good. God, please take your position at the front and get ready to pull. Wait, the guard's the one pulling it? They have horses, but... Oh, okay. I was like, I was like, damn, like a rickshaw? As you make your way in in wonderful steadings, uh, I'm gonna telepathically ping Byron. When we get back, if you can find the opportunity, maybe talk to Maven or Barnabas here about maybe clearing your criminal record. I don't have a criminal I thought you said you was a horse thief. They said I was a horse thief. Ah. Fuck. <laughs> a horse is meant to be free, not beaten and broken into submission. Quint will turn for it at the guard's woman. <laughs> See, try to gauge, is he turning these beasts right? As she walks along, uh, she seems far more irritated than anything. Okay, that's that's all right. But you make it back to the compound. Oh, I wonder if there's the little... Give us the compound map. Glorious compound map. Zane and I probably met uh, Rohan there first. Delivering Kellendale. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's the wrong one. Did anyone let oh, me pick up? Yeah, I like it. I did very much. <laughs> I thought it was a hand at first, and I see you went for the well, elementary well, school I, <laughs> turkey. Yeah, I, I put my hand on my computer screen. <laughs> I knew <laughs> it. I knew it. Really? it. I traced it. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful. My thumb isn't really that fat, I just lost track. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Yeah, you know, if you had a big thumb, I wouldn't have called you. <laughs> <about it. laughs> so, as you make it back, put myself here. Just, you know, see the guard off and get these peacocks situated. <laughs> As they get situated and brought over to Lady Elena, you do see a pacing back and forth uh, Antonius at yeah. the middle ground of the stairs. As the doors open and you see him, he just says, Perfect, I've been waiting for you. That's a hell of a way to start a conversation, but I wouldn't have any other way. We we had Salamanca in like a like return crew, right? Like everyone was accounted for, like chaperone head count. Okay, double check. Uh here you go. Boom. Oh! <laughs> what when did you copy when did you copy this? I just moved him there and put him to GM layer. Ah. Ah. <clears throat> Can't wait to find all the duplicates. <laughs> I hit control A to select I knew I was on the map somewhere I just hit control A and delete because <laughs> I was like I'm not going to bother as you make your way in he just says a moment of your time if you have it to spare what's up and uh should I be addressing you differently should a captain address another one differently? If I'm being honest, I don't really know. I've only been captain for like less than a day. <laughs> Congratulations. Nice. As such, he throws out a handshake. Take it. Grabs you by the wrist. Yeah. You do Good. have business to attend to. I saw Grand Watcher Maven's map. One of the targets moved very quickly towards two other of our targets. We're about to go address that right now. That's our classmates, Carolyn and Flora. They were... Ah. Uh, looks over his shoulder at Bradford. What were they doing? Uh, being stuck by what they describe as Frogna. Uh, I think it's uh, No, no, not that. I, can... I meant, like, why, the way they were out there in the first place. I heard that in the first place. Um, actually, hold on. That's a really good question. Wh whatever. They're, they're out there doing some uh, sentinel details. And now they're getting stalked by what the Carolyn speculates is a figment or fragment of Regaldna. Or, my bad, Regaldna. Regaldna's other half. We suspect it's our other brother. The one that got darkened during the exhibition match. Or well, one of them. Regaldna is the other half to Fraudna. Correct. Call it a full moon versus a dark moon. Still both a moon. I see. We're about to make our way out there to try to go save him. And maybe recover, Gregor. If it's him. But... With that report, just read him. It has to be. Hmm. That's possible. <sighs> Can we be of assistance? Maven told me. Apologies. Grand Watch and Maven told me some people were already allocated to certain missions, duties, details. Who's left? I have my crew. What I'm not sure about is if we'll be enough. Hmm. I've opted to take down those cloning facilities. That's gonna be... I mean, we did it before. We beat them. 
in a pretty bloodless way, but that's when we had a lot more at our disposal. But this time you guys are the only surprise. Uh, Should that <laughs> recon go poorly? We will need a call for aid. Though Troy is a place of ill repute, neon lights, and a bastardization of the Velcourt with its tall spires. If you haven't already, I would recommend talking to some of the White Watch. I won't, I won't be surprised if any of them already know the ins and outs of the place, but if not, I'm sure they're keenly specialized in fighting in it. I couldn't agree more. That's why I lobbied for River and Devereaux on my team. Makes sense. Then we take Kadash, Julia. He looks over and red. Follow his gaze at Red Fox. What you doing? Sitting there waiting for her name to be called. It's... Like, motherfucker, you better not keep me off that list. <laughs> Oh, she got picked last for <laughs> picked last for dodgeball. So who's that leave us? Looks at Salamaka. <laughs> and what about me? Am I not a blood cloak? Salamaka, I am not Captain Diana. You are a liability. Oh. Yeah. He sits there stunned for a second. Sam. We can't afford to need to be bailing you out. We can't mm. afford a weak link. I'm sorry, but I'm sure there will be opportunities in the borderlands for you. Oh, <laughs> oh hell no. Fuck, wh where am I? <laughs> Fuck you're right here. I? You're you're walking by. Uh, uh... <laughs> Hang out with the scorpion. He he calls him a borderland bandit so loud that we both hear it inside, and we're like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> you just feel the earth tremble as Rohan starts running over here. That won't be the case. We don't got the we don't got the numbers to start assigning people to borderlands unless it's necessary. That's not to diminish your capabilities, Salmanka. And in fairness, in his defense, Sentinelus, he did keep the East Watch on the class safe. He nods. That's good to hear. Truly. And I say this with no malice or ill intent. This fight is just not your fight. I see. He throws up a very lifeless salute before it's returned sternly by Antonius. As he leaves and the doors close, look at Antonius. I knew he had a bit of a chip on his shoulder. This is, is he really genuinely that detrimental? To the common people, no. He would be exceptional. He's not even subpar in any way, I would say. But we just can't afford. We can't afford average right now. Hmm. Perhaps if we had an easier mission. We do not. You guys are going against a nasty bunch. I mean. We debriefed, right? We heard what they got. 
part stoppers, multi holds. Yeah, it's gonna be rough. I might go talk to him there. Yes, if you feel inclined to, I'm sure it would help. Tough business, but that's how business is done. Good luck on your mission, Clint. You as well. We'll be heading out shortly. I imagine us still. Assuming the planes, uh, gonna be fast to fix up. Good hunting. And to you. He nods to you, Bradford. Keep them safe out there. <laughs> yeah, of course. As he walks out to gather his team, <sighs> it's about the last time we see some of these people. It's like walking down to Bradford. I doubt yes, it. Do. They seem too stubborn to die. <laughs> I want to go with you. I'm not what? opposed to the idea in principle, but might I ask why? We've only been through one year, but we're damn well as good as any watcher that's graduated. <laughs> Maybe blue better, better in some regards, but yeah. I think you guys are all very specialized, that's for certain. Okay. So Point that proves... We can hold our own. You can, I don't doubt that. So why are you asking to come on this mission? Because Gregor and Carolyn meant a lot to all of us. Clint blinks under his visor that? You mean... This isn't you asking. It's all of you asking. He nods. That. Whatever room you have to afford. Okay. I want to be there. Mule can stay and work on the plane. That's what he's good at. We're gonna need that plane just to get out there, so he won't be staying and working on it, I'm afraid. Let me think on it. I'll come find you. And let you know. Although I am leaning towards a yes. As of these we'll wait by now. the boat then. That's a good idea. Not at that. Uh, all right, I need to go check in. Come on. Uh, I'll check along. Uh, it's just sort of talking backwards, really. Like he's walking forward, but just sort of speaking to the air uh, to Bradford behind him. Well, I'll find Cleo and Rohan. I'm sure it won't be hard to find them. Listen for the loudest guy in the room. We need a, we need a game plan to go take down Gregor. As well as maybe some religious input on this. How do we fight the avatar of a... Stops, turns, dark? Gone. Uh. A shaky hand of like maybe <laughs> yeah actually maybe we can find Zane he protects his sisters right they're avatars oh, yeah. of well maybe not avatars of gods but they got godly energy in them right yeah and with the wicked high passive perception he probably sees Zane right there <laughs> yeah. yeah we should probably go chat with him I really don't want to establish another silent. No, they're all right here. Yeah, I was looking at surprise. <laughs> oh, there you are. Quinn just sort of whispers in his mind to the, the prince. Man, these powers are crazy, man. <laughs> <laughs> just the people I was looking for. Look at Kellendale. Please tell me he's going with us. Please tell me he's going with us. Please tell me he's going with us right now. How, how messed up oh, he's he here. Was. He's dead. And he's gone. <laughs> he escaped again. SCP. Oh no, Captain Rivers is looking a little thin there. 
Oh, he's suddenly bulkier. <laughs> Looks oh, right, like he, right, right. Yeah, he has his, his, his new evil art. He's punished. <laughs> his punished art. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, don't worry, I'm getting a new Captain Severus token. Oh, that sounds bad. I don't like yeah, that. <laughs> he's gonna uh, one of the hollows in Dark Souls but with a really thin like oh, he wants. He's gonna He's gonna become oh, his twink oh. elf form. No. He's gonna be this thin. <laughs> <laughs> That's a whip the entire token. He doesn't take up, he's not medium sized anymore. <laughs> anyways, anyways. I see you guys were successful with uh Kellendale. Yeah, I was able to save him. Well, good job. Staring at him for a moment. A day. Yeah, two missions in a day. Went pretty well, huh? Mm. Am, I, am I going for a three for? Uh, what, what, what is it? What, what, did we, did, did Bradford disclose the uh, Carolyn's? That was only to Clint, right? Yeah, at I, least. I did, like, Mentally ping you on that one? Yeah. I don't know if we would have had I don't know. Time. Now's a good time to dispense that information. De yeah, definitely yeah. not Cleo and Zane because they, they had to dip in the middle of the match. Yeah. Yeah, okay, so. Uh, <laughs> Clint, <laughs> Bradford. <laughs> blah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Carolyn, so Gregor. We... Okay, another guy. <laughs> Flora, there we go. So we. <laughs> Spent a long so we got... <sighs> Yes. I'm just I'm gonna bank on Lucian and Rocket, Mule, William, whoever's on that to fix a point very soon. But I don't know if you guys in your religious institutions have any idea on Regalna, or more importantly, combating him. Would I have any anything? <laughs> uh, yeah, would we? On Regalna? I mean, wait, on Regalna or Fraudna? Either, I suppose, since both are probably mentioned. Uh, yeah. They are both mentioned. Which one is stalking them? Okay. Ray Gaudna, yeah. because that's the cursed hand one. Ooh, yes. See, this is tough. Gaudna's in the, the gardens. That your characters don't have, but could be given it if, you know... If shit happens. Some of, some of y'all remembered. Uh, okay, roll a religion. Um, I'm dispensing out three bardics immediately. <laughs> Oh god. Wow. Oh, I'm Holy crazy. shit, guys. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, do you god. do any of you have your yeah, rerolls, don't have, please? Like, bad mods on these either, right? This is oh We god. don't have our ring rerolls yet either. It's been <laughs> the same day for like Bro. A game. I mean like it was a oh, hard roll in like, the first place, but you didn't even show up with like your C game on that one. Least, you guys all roll below like ten, like statistically speaking. Yeah. Okay. Um Yep. We tried. <laughs> we tried. Well, I mean, Fraudna's definitely, you know, <laughs> they call, you know, were creatures children of Fraudna, and they're super strong against vampires. So. Oh, um, you don't say. The, the bestial children of her, right? That are, you mm -hmm. know, do the were thing, and um, they're good against vampires. That's, uh, that's about all I remember. Does it go the other way back? To that extent of my knowledge as well. Looks to Ron to what? see if we got a three for on that info. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you see the banjo shift as he opens his mouth to say something <laughs> and closes his mouth and shakes his head. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. What about this uh, garden yeah. that Carolyn you, was bringing up? You see Eastmanos sort of looking back and forth at Kelnio. But haven't you ever considered why? Children of Fraudna are so strong against vampires. Especially the Vargul. Now we know some Psychusian context, but not any religious or anatomical reason. I've never heard of this Regaldna. Regaldna, yeah. Who is it? We're out in his other half, I assume, or sibling. No. But thinks back to the cosmic insight he got. Siblings. Mm. So they are two sides of the same gold. Right. Uh, 
Uh, roll uh, history. See if you remember. Oh boy. Uh, let me okay, check. Let's do it. Fast. Uh, yeah. Roll, 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 roll oh, you one. two specifically who were there in Sycusia. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking. Yeah, I remember like the statues. Uh, so I have divine inspiration applies to this, but I'm not gonna you bust it out just yet unless I need it. Uh, histoire. Oh, quick! You gotta go up. There it is. <laughs> I have part of myself. Hey. 27? Uh, 7. Yeah, you remember specifically that they were very much opposites of each other. Yeah, I was thinking the of like that. Wolf and blue eyed Fraudna and the red eyed black furred vampire bat Regaldna. You also remember that specifically Sekusi was doing experiments on wolf blooded children of Fraudna. Right. They're trying to replicate it. Or maybe not replicate it, but get some energy aspect out of it. Right. Which combined with the truth that their mutations or fiendish variables in God's plan means that the energy that they're trying to manipulate with Regalda and Regalda is the same fiendish energy. Looks at Renvark. So, what? yeah, they're, I mean, they're darkened children of Raudna. So Regaudna would be the corruption of the children. Mm. Meaning what's corrupted them? Right. So Regaudna is all the good that can be in humanity. Mm -hmm. Or sorry, Fraudna is. The Rogaldna is the opposite. Quint dispenses out this information, just sort of muttering to himself in a more than halfway madman way. Oh, it's like we need to take down a strong child of Fraudna that's been darkened. That's gonna be hard. I mean, when Jericho darkened, he became immensely more powerful. Can't imagine what's gonna do for Gregor. Hmm. Not to make things worse for you boys. <laughs> but all the children are frowned the hunt in this winter. So there you might be might... an alien dark one where they're actually stronger. You might have one, yes. Unfortunate as that is. 